tens of thousands worth of equipment is now missing from a construction site in Roxborough. Authorities say it was the work of some brazen thieves. A total of three businesses were impacted by this. Action News reporting Anna McCormick is live at one of those businesses and you spoke with one of the owners, Annie. Yeah, and Christy, the amount of equipment that was sold in total $65,000, and this all happened in broad daylight. And get this, the thief actually left with the haul and then continued to return for more. He would come make his trips here and there. Just after 6 in the morning on Sunday, this white BMW pulled up to this Roxborough job site in the 5200 block of Umbria and stole thousands of dollars of equipment. They entered through this fence. Just the longer I watched the video, the more upset I became. Gary Carter's business is one of three businesses on the site that the person stole from. His loss amounted to about 25 grand. In total, the entire loss from all three businesses totaled $65,000. Over a window of two hours, the culprit even left the site and drove back for more, cleaning out job site trailers and targeting specific equipment. One of the things in uh, most expensive uh, pieces of equipment they stolen was a, a total station that's uh, it's like a surveying layout to keep all your building straight and square. Um, also like um, our laser levels, all of our cordless uh, drills, soles, uh, chipping guns, uh, bulldog guns and uh, laptops, iPad. Northwest detectives are investigating the crime. Carter was able to obtain this video Monday afternoon. A small business owner is at a loss. Last night I had to go out and buy some equipment that I already paid for, so it hurt my pockets a little bit. Just get your life together and like you're driving a nice car. It was a BMW, seemed like a later model. Um, I'm not sure how you got it, but if you want to give it back, just give it back. Like no questions asked. That's all I ask. You know, like we work hard for our money. Now, Carter has said that he has ruled out that this was an inside job. Additionally, he and other workers on the site are working on a solution to have eyes on this site 24 7. For now, reporting live in Roxborough, Annie McCormick, Channel 6, Action News. Great. Yeah, we can sense the frustration. Okay, Annie, thanks for the update.